Good morning campers, it's June 22nd, 2015 and this is a continuing update on the electric Carmagia project. Made a lot of progress. This is basically my project board. You see we started on it, it was a daily driver, it was delivered on 421 and uh, so where we are today. We just got the tires mounted, front end is going to be aligned tomorrow. These are basically my support diagrams. And outside here is the project. So, where are we today? Well, got most of this complete. I'm going to be fabricating a cover for the top of this. But we'll be carrying a spare since this thing's only got a range of about 25 one way. I can always call and have it towed in. Plus, I don't have to carry that weight around. So that'll be blocked off. And groceries and stuff will go in there. Got the wheels mounted. So haven't put the baby moons on them yet. But. That's what they'll look like uh, when these tires wear out. I will go with white walls. So, here's what it looks like. Red and the silver is going to pop. Red is going to be matched. I'm going to break the line right here. I'm going to have a red top in a couple of weeks. Still got to put the door panels on. Waiting for some parts to come in make them easier to roll up still waiting on <coughs> the panels to go in here so I can finish this out and get it all covered up and I'm going to be putting the, the bumpers on uh, they've all been prepped painted 415 and everything else. So, this is what the back turned out to look like. I can't see too well because of the lighting. But that little plastic case contains all the electronics, the glue electronics, the big, big stuff. And then down in here, underneath this, is my battery which I've got cases for all of these but I've got to bottom balance all these first so all this stuff's got to come back apart and do some work on it I'm gonna have a tie down from that bolt back in there uh, to come back up into here strap over I've got a top on it unit back there you can barely see it it's black that's my DC to DC converter. It puts out about 30 amps. So I gotta measure that. And then up here I've got the Garmin set up. I'll be feeding a line of power from the vent back here so that the Garmin won't have all that wire and shit hanging down there. But uh, it's pretty much done up here. I might put a footrest down there. Having a little bit of trouble with this door. It's stiff when I roll it up. But, and let's see, I relocated the hook trunk latch up there, hit all the wiring down in there. So there's no wiring of any kind in here. It all runs through the heater cable. Got the seat belt in. Antenna on. Tomorrow we'll get those adjusted. Uh, gonna have to decide what I'm gonna do with the uh, split speedometer. It's not hooked up yet, other than just the cable. There's really not much I need there, other than a turn indicator, which and a high beam indicator, functionally up in the miles per hour. If I can get miles per hour off the of Garmin. So we'll see what happens, but fuse box, uh, that's where the old gas tank came in, I have that blocked off, but, let's see, 
it's got a good 20 foot paint job on it so that's about it over and out